In this video, I'll give a full explanation of the black square demo where something that feels colder melts ice faster. The first concept we need to understand is thermal equilibrium. Because these blocks have been sitting out in the room, they are the same temperature as their surroundings, and there is no flow of energy. So if the air temperature is around 22 degrees Celsius, the blocks are also at that same temperature. So even though these blocks are the same temperature, when you touch them, one will feel warmer and one will feel colder. So let's try to understand what's going on. The first thing we'll note is that you are at about 37 degrees Celsius, so you are warmer than the blocks. The second law of thermodynamics tells us that because you are the warmer object, heat will flow from you into the blocks. The reason they don't feel the same temperature is because they're not made of the same material. The one that feels warmer is made of a plastic, whereas the one that feels colder is made of aluminum. Now plastic is a thermal insulator, which means that heat does not easily flow either into or out of it, whereas aluminum is a thermal conductor, so heat can easily flow into it or flow out of it. Now because of this, the heat from your finger actually flows faster away from you, which makes it feel colder because you're losing heat faster to the aluminum block as opposed to the plastic block. Now we can take what we've learned and apply it to the ice cubes and understand why the one on the right will melt faster. The first thing we'll note is that the blocks are warmer than the ice cube, therefore heat is gonna flow from the blocks into the ice. Since the block on the right is the thermal conductor, heat flows more quickly from the block into the ice and therefore it melts at a quicker rate. So to summarize, the block on the right is a conductor, which is why it feels colder, because heat flows more easily from your finger into the block, whereas it melts the ice faster because the block is warmer and heat flows more quickly from the block into the ice, making it melt faster. Here's a thermal image of what's happening, where it shows that the ice on the right is melting faster and the block is actually getting colder. Since its thermal energy is going into the ice to melt it, it cools off the block at a faster rate. I hope you enjoyed this video and as always, thanks for watching.